Have you ever felt like you were being super needy? It's not uncommon for people to worry about being seen as needy when expressing their needs, but it's important to understand that there's a difference between genuine neediness and simply fulfilling basic human needs. In this video, we'll explore three signs that show you're not actually needy, but really just addressing your basic human needs. Seeking emotional support. Picture this, you're dealing with a stressful situation at work and it's taking a toll on your mental health. One evening, you decide to call a close friend for support. As the conversation unfolds, you begin to feel lighter and more supported. Your friend's empathy and understanding helps you regain perspective and reminds you that you're not alone in your struggles. There are times when life throws you curveballs, leaving you feeling down or overwhelmed. In those moments, it's completely natural to seek comfort and understanding from others, family, or loved ones. Don't worry. Reaching out for support doesn't make you needy. Instead, it shows that you understand the importance of connection and validation, which are essential aspects of emotional well-being. Research professor, Dr. Brene Brown, highlights the significance of vulnerability and connection in her work. When you open up to others, you not only foster deeper connections, but also build resilience and a sense of belonging. Dr. Brown's research suggests that seeking comfort and understanding from others during tough times is a fundamental aspect of your emotional well-being. So the next time you find yourself feeling guilty or worried about appearing needy, remember that it's perfectly natural and healthy to lean on your support network. Desiring clear communication. Imagine this, you're having a conversation with a close friend about a recent disagreement. Instead of keeping your feelings bottled up, you decide to openly express your thoughts and seek clarity about what led to the misunderstanding. As you both share your perspectives, you begin to understand each other better and the conversation helps to strengthen your bond. When you want to express your thoughts and feelings or seek clarity in your interactions, it doesn't mean you're needy. It's simply a reflection of your desire for strong communication and mutual understanding. Psychologist and relationship expert, Dr. John Gottman, highlights the importance of effective communication in his research on relationship stability. By engaging in open and honest conversations, you can foster trust, understanding, and stronger connections with those around you. Dr. Gottman's research supports the idea that open communication is crucial for healthy relationships. So the next time you feel the need to express your thoughts or seek clarity, remember that it's not a sign of neediness, but rather an indication of your commitment to nurturing your connections with others. Valuing quality time. Imagine this, you've been feeling a little disconnected from a close friend due to your busy schedules. One day, you decide to reach out and suggest meeting up for coffee or going for a walk together. During your time together, you reconnect, share stories, and laugh, feeling the bond between you grow stronger. Spending quality time with the people you care about is essential for maintaining strong bonds and nurturing relationships. When you enjoy being with your loved ones and occasionally ask them to hang out, it's not a sign of neediness. Instead, it shows that you value your relationship and are willing to invest time and energy in them. Dr. Sue Johnson, a clinical psychologist and developer of emotionally focused therapy, EFT, highlights the importance of nurturing emotional connections in her research on attachment and relationships. Spending time together helps to strengthen the bonds you share with your loved ones and contributes to your overall well-being. Dr. Johnson's research underscores the significance of investing time and energy into our relationships. So, the next time you worry about appearing needy when asking to spend time with loved ones, remember that it's a natural and healthy way to nurture the connections that are important to you. Can you relate to any of these signs? It's important to remember that seeking support, engaging in open conversation, and spending quality time with others are all natural parts of being human. Share your experiences and thoughts in the comments. And don't hesitate to share this content with friends who might find it interesting. See you next time.